Hi guys, Toby here for TP23 Productions. Now, back with a DVD review, and this time around I'm reviewing a film called House of Nine. In all honesty, House of Nine is not the greatest film that will go down in the archives of DVD folklore history. Um, it's, it's an okay sort of film, kind of a big brother sort of uh, film really. You've got Dennis Hopper, who stars in it, and then you've also got Kelly Brook. They're really the two biggest stars of the film. The uh, gist of the story is that you've got nine strangers, and each of these nine strangers who have nothing really in common, uh, they get picked off randomly, they get drugged, and they put up in this big house. Nine of them in a house. House of nine. And uh, there's a voice that you hear, and uh, the one voice says, if you survive, and there's only one sole survivor, then you will get five million dollars as a reward. Great. But then you get some people who think, I don't know, they, they, they think about the money more than what the consequences could be. As each day goes on, the food rations get less and less and less, and uh, there's alcohol involved, and uh, people start to think about the money more than the fact of human life. Uh, it's an okay film, not great. It gets better towards the end, and it also shows the greed and envy of what a person would do with five million dollars on the line. The main reason I really got it was Kelly Brook. I'm a big Kelly Brook fan, and that's really the reason I got it. There is one scene that sticks out for me, and it's a bit, uh, I don't know, it's, it's a bit hard, not hard to watch, but it's like wow, this is what you're going to do for $5 million. And I mean, what happens, the guy who gets the wrong end of the stick, really, he, uh, yeah, it's a bit gruesome. Um, but it's 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 an okay film. You've got Dennis Hopper, who's a priest, and he's trying to ration with everyone. Uh, you've got Asher D, who plays sort of a London Cockney sort of gangster as a... Uh, it is renowned in the hip hop world, and uh, he thinks he's better than everyone. And uh, there's a policeman who tries to ration everything, and Dennis Hopper, who's the priest, who tries to calm everyone down and bless the father and all that. There is a good twist at the end. I didn't see it coming, which was pretty good. Um, sets itself up for a sequel. Uh, if you're a Dennis Hopper fan and you've got all his other films, then get it by all means. If you're a Kelly Brook fan, then get it. Um, but it's an okay film it's not going to go down in the folklores of history as a great film if you haven't heard of it I'm not surprised really uh, but it's it's an okay film if you like the big brother sort of twist uh, then you you might like this film but uh, don't forget guys Toby WTD gives you 20% off anything from We The Devoted all the links down below but thank you for watching House of Nine it's an okay film if you're a Dennis Hopper fan, then get it. If you like Big Brother, uh, then get it. And if you're a Kelly Brook fan, then get it. Okay film, but uh, not going to go go down as uh, one of the greatest films ever made. So guys, thank you for watching my review. Uh, don't forget, check out Weed of the Devoted, 20% off. But thank you for watching my review of House of Nine.